Hi guys, Jackie Stroll here. Today is day 37 of our 100 Days to Prosperity Challenge. Uh, excuse me, my voice is a little hoarse. I'm a little sick, but I am fine. I am here, and today we are going to discuss your marketing business plan. So stick around, it's gonna be great. And welcome back. For those of you who do not know me, my name is Jackie Stroll. I'm an affiliate marketer, and that's what this channel is dedicated to. Um, I love being an entrepreneur. Entrepreneurs are problem solvers. Entrepreneurs help people. So I want to help the world make their own online business and be successful from home. I'm just barely getting started in this. I started in July, I believe it was as an affiliate marketer, um, but I've already had some some success and my business is growing every day little by little and I'm taking actions every single day and that's what this 100 Days to Prosperity Challenge is all about, right? Um, I'm taking action every single day in my business on YouTube and on Facebook. So I wanna take this journey with you. If you're new here, please subscribe below, hit that bell notification so you see my my videos every day when I post them. I'm um, really sorry. my, my voice is a little sore, my throat's a little sore today, but I'm here, I love being here and doing this for you. So please hit that subscribe button if you're new here. So today, on this week, I'm kind of going back to basics. Yesterday I kind of went off track and talked about something else, but we're going back to basics today and talking about getting started as an affiliate marketer. And today I wanna to share with you seven steps to get going as an affiliate marketer, okay? This is, uh, stuff for newbies to understand and steps for you to follow, okay? So let's get going. Number one, find your product, right? I recommend selling something that has a value ladder, meaning at the beginning of your offer, you offer something really low end, but as people get to know you, they're gonna to wanna to purchase more from you. So your ladder needs to keep going up and up with value and in price. So pick your product, that's number one. Number two, get your links, right? Make sure that you have your links um, in a capture page that you set up. One of the biggest mistakes a new affiliate can make is only using your affiliate link to promote. You need to build your email list. That is your greatest asset. That is your money maker right there. You need to build your email list. And you do that by creating your own capture page, capturing people's emails first, and then selling, sending them over to your affiliate offer. I did a video on this not long ago. I will link it right here. Oh, sorry, wrong side, right here. Okay, that's the video that you need to check out if you want to know how to set up a capture page properly. Number three, learn how to market. So you need to pick a platform and market on that. I chose YouTube because I love being people being able to see my face and relate to me one-on-one -on -one and know that I'm a real person and that I'm genuine and that I really love to help, right? I think that helps me build trust with my customers and um, with my audience. So I chose YouTube, but I, I also use Facebook for that same reason. But there's lots of platforms out there. So you, you can research which one fits your needs, which one that you would like to do. Do it, pick one to start and run with it, master one, and then move on and grow and scale, okay? Uh, number four, place ads. Run ads every day or as much as possible according to your budget, okay? The more you're getting your offer in front of the right people, the more success you're going to have. I struggle with this because I have a small budget, but I'm finding other ways to get my offers in front of people, okay? There's there's free ways and there's paid ways. Free is going to take a little longer. Paid it will always rule over free uh, because you can reach more people faster that way. But make sure you're placing ads, marketing, and in putting your offer in front of your audience every single day or you're not going to get results. Number five, join a Facebook community of like-minded people. These people will help support you. They will answer questions for you. It's kind of like having a mentor. Um, if you can't afford to get a coach or if you don't have a coach or a mentor, this is a great way to reach out and get help. You can find lots and lots of people who have been through the same problems, same struggles that you're having, and reach out to them and find out 
how to fix your problem, right? So join a Facebook community with like-minded people. I highly, highly, highly recommend this. And number six, go to live webinars weekly. Try to branch out to other companies who are in the sim similar niche to yours, see what they're doing, and you might learn some new tips and tricks, okay? Um, I'm kind of dipping into other niches right now. I'm gonna be actually on a live webinar next week with somebody that asked me to come and tell my story. And I'm doing this so that I can learn and grow, right? And also share my story with everybody. So make sure you're attending live webinars um, and other training courses. You can, most of the time they're free. Uh, make sure you're attending these regularly so that you're always up to date on what's going on and you're in this business, you're always learning and growing. Continue your education every single chance that you get. It's so important. It's going to help you stay plugged into your business, keep your ideas fresh, and keep you going and going strong. And number seven, action, 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 action. Content, 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 content. Always be putting out content. Always be taking action. Make sure you're you're answering questions that people have. Uh, make sure you're making videos every day. Make sure you're posting regularly on Facebook like I do. But those are the platforms that I use. Again, let's get you what works for you. But I'm taking action every single day. And that is the biggest thing. I'm getting out there and just making this happen little by little every single day. And that's what this business takes. If you're not committed to doing that, it's it's going to be a rough go for you. This is what it takes. And if you're not willing to put in the work, then maybe you need to switch gears, right? So those are my seven steps to get going as a new affiliate marketer. If you have any questions for me, feel free to comment below or you can email me at info at JackieStroll.com. I'm always here to help or send me a friend request on Facebook too, okay? Or a private message on Facebook too. My page is linked below, so please check that out. And I look forward to seeing you guys tomorrow for day 38. This is just flying by. I can't believe how well it's going and how, how much I've learned so far. And I love taking this journey with all of you. So thank you so, so, so much for watching. Uh, please hit that thumbs up button. It sure helps me a lot. I will see you tomorrow. Thank mm -hmm. you.